Hey everyone, welcome back to the Awesomer Pop channel. This is another raspy voiceover edition. Today we'll be making ice cream. Just kidding. It looks like ice cream, right? But they're actually cookies. And they're super delicious, so I can't wait to share the recipe. To make these cookies, we'll need 12 tablespoons of butter or one and a half sticks. This is why the cookie's delicious. We got a whole lot of butter in it. Well, this may look like a lot of butter, but don't worry. It's the perfect amount. All right, now let's mix this butter up. We don't want the butter to be super clunky. Make it nice and creamy. Okay, now we're going to add another delicious ingredient into our bowl. We need to pour in a 3 4 cup of powdered sugar. This is going to make our cookies super sweet. And we all know butter and sugar go really well together. Alright, so you want to keep mixing until the powdered sugar completely dissolves. This might take a bit, so I'll skip ahead. I got you guys. Okay, there we go. Much better. Now let's add a teaspoon of vanilla extract for more flavor. Mix this all up. Okay, now we're going to be making our cookie dough. So let's add two cups of cake flour into the bowl. Use a sifter if you can. This will help get rid of lumps. Now we have super fine cake flour. Let's mix this all up. Ah, I love baking, but there's always a lot of mixing to do. And I just realized this might be the first video you're watching, and you're probably wondering why my voice is like this. I lost it over the weekend, and I'm still in the recovery process. And no, it's nothing serious. It's totally my fault from a lot of shouting. But you'll probably hear this raspy voice for a week, and I apologize for that. Okay, at a certain point, you probably need to get your hands dirty and start kneading the dough. Just a little more. Oh, that one was bad. But our cookie dough is finished. All right, since we're making a rainbow ice cream cookie, let's make a few different dough colors. Give me a minute while I separate the dough into different bowls. And I'm going to stop talking for now to rest my voice. Okay, let's start by making the red dough. Mix it up. Okay, now that we have our cookie dough color, let's grab a little piece and roll it into a ball. You want to make them about the size of a golf ball. Or to make it easier, make four even sized ones. Okay, now let's make the yellow dough. Mix it up. We have four yellow dough balls. Okay, now let's make blue. Perfect. Now let's make green. This part gets a little messy because the food coloring will get on your hands, but it's totally worth it. Awesome! We're finished! Alright, try to separate the colors so that there's not too much of one color on a certain side. Doesn't this look pretty already? Now what we need to do is press down on the dough. Keep pressing down on the dough until you get a flat surface. Nice! Now it looks like we have a large amount of ice cream in the bowl. Now let's use this ice cream scooper to grab a scoop. The reason why we press down on the dough is to get the ice cream texture when we use the scooper. Now let's place the scoop on a piece of parchment paper. Whoa, look at that! That looks pretty real! Alright! Let's grab another scoop. Ooh, that's a pretty looking scoop too. This is also why you want to separate the dough colors. You'll end up getting really pretty scoops. Okay, that should be enough. Now let's throw these in the oven. You want to set your oven to 325 degrees and bake them for 20 minutes. After 20 minutes, let them cool before eating. Alright, here's how our cookies look. 
They still look like ice cream scoops after baking, but we all know they're delicious cookies. Actually, we don't know if they're delicious yet. Gotta do a taste test to make sure. Let's see how this cookie looks on the inside. This cookie looks pretty dense. Oh yeah, it is pretty dense. But my goodness, that's amazing. I love butter cookies. You can taste the vanilla, the butter, and the sugar. It can get a little dry, so maybe grab a glass of milk or something like that. Besides that, this gets an A+. I love the taste and how it looks. Super, super, super good. Give it a try. Well, hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to click that subscribe button for more awesome videos. See ya!